My name is Tanner. I'm an account executive, and I would give join.me a solid three. Uh, and for more video reviews, uh, check out the ones below. So before we had join.me, uh, we were using things like um, Google Meet and a few other products that were out at the time, uh, like Zoom, uh, earlier versions of it, uh, but join.me had sort of a lightweight uh, browser extension that you could just start a meeting really quick. Uh, so for the ease of things, just to do quick one-offs, uh, that's why we started using join.me. At the given time, join.me, um, it was much simpler to sign up. You didn't need like a big price plan uh, just to have some simple meetings between staff. Uh, so for the ease of use and the lower price point was the primary reasons we decided to go with join.me. Join.me was fairly simple to get set up. You just did the download. You got a nice little uh, tab on your desktop where you could just click start a meeting and share that link with anybody and it just started right up. You didn't have to you know, set up specific calendar events and get people to RSVP. It was just, hey, here's a link. Jump on with me real quick. Let's chat. Um, so it was nice and lightweight and an easy option to get started with. If anyone's thinking about join.me, um, I believe it's been bundled into GoToWebinar as an option now, uh, so I would definitely check out that package that they have. Um, it, at the time, the video quality wasn't as great as other services, but I think it's probably been upgraded now since they joined with uh, GoToWebinar. Um, so I would definitely check out the newest price plans that they have and see if it's comparable to what you need. You know, if you need webinar specific services on top of just a basic meeting service you're going to have to pay more but if you just need a basic meeting service it's not too terribly priced